Hello everybody, my name is Markiplier and welcome back to the custom story A Coward's Debt. I'm starting to understand that the coward in this story is actually me! I'm a terrible coward, not just because the monsters that I haven't actually seen yet are trying to kill me. It's because that my character is trying to get away from paying off his partner who helped make him rich. And if you are exploiting the work of others and passing it off as your own, you definitely deserve to go insane in your own brain, be shot in the head and then spiral down into chaos forever and ever as you discover the agony of your own insanity. If that was poetic enough for you, I appreciate your uh, appreciation of my poetic nature because I, in my heart of hearts, I know that I have no idea where I'm going. I'm actually going in circles, I believe. I do not need to go this way because I've already gone this way. This is where I got the candle to go forward. Now, it's still very, very dark. And it's still very, very hard for me to get by. I don't know if I, like, missed in the beginning of the game there was actually a lantern that I was supposed to get a while ago, or if I'm just a fool who's trying to get by with nothing. But I've got an empty bottle and an inclination that I need to go fill it with a certain strange chemical substance and then deliver that to someone else. So I'm gonna go back to the first floor and explore the other doorways that I saw because there might be something there that I need. Yup, da -dup, da -dup, da -dup, da -dup, da -dup, da -dup. Ow, my brains. Ah, I see it, okay, I didn't see it before. There was a key in the fire where I put my hand and burned myself. So I need to fill this bottle up with water, which I could probably do in the bathroom that I saw earlier. Where was that? I was wondering why there was a point to this bathroom. There must be something in here that can help me fill up this bottle. Yes! Scoop it out of the toilet! Get toilet water. Who cares? If it works, it's gonna work for me. So that means I can pour this over the fire, get that key out of there, find out what door of the million that are locked this key goes to. I don't have any tinder boxes. I know that, friend. Just give me the key. Ah, a safe key. So there must be a safe behind some painting somewhere that I am then able to unlock. And I probably overlooked it before. I am very good at overlooking simple details like that. It's not because I'm going through this too quickly, it's because my brain isn't actively picking up on things. 50% of my brain power right now is dedicated to making commentary for you guys. Although my commentary skills may be lacking, I try my hardest. I'm gonna guess that the safe is probably... Oh, key to the office safe. Okay, so there is definitely a safe in one of these offices. It may be this one, but then again it may not be, so I'll come back when I find it. Well, this wouldn't be an authentic 100% homegrown Markiplier video if I didn't get lost everywhere! What did I do? What is that? What happened? Where am I? What is going on here? Wait a minute, wait one goddamn second here! Wait one goddamn second! What did I just trigger? What just happened? Who is you? Okay. Okay, that's the bar down there. But I don't need to go down to the bar. I need to worry about what the hell is happening right now. What the hell was that? Is that the new monster? Or was that just ambionic noise? I have no idea. Okay. Until I find out otherwise, I'm gonna assume that was nothing. And I need to go this way now because I need to go back to an office in the beginning of the game and find where the ding damn safe was. So as soon as I find the safe, the sooner I can move on. But I'm guessing it's not gonna be that easy. You're not just gonna give it up to me. I gotta coax it out of you. I gotta buy you dinner. I gotta get you a few drinks. I gotta soothe you. I gotta make you swoon for me until you give me that safe. Or whatever the hell's in the safe. Okay, this is a bar. This would be a nice office to have if I was a drunkard. But then again, I am not. So it's not good for me. But maybe my character is. You never know with these guys. Office. This looks office-y. Is there a safe in here? There's some sort of a safety thing. Something to keep my valuables. Maybe even my sanity. I'm guessing maybe the office was the place where the picture of Alexander was. But I don't recall there being a safe in there. And that would be a lot of backtracking in my opinion, but then again, maybe this is all about backtracking. What happened? Oh, hi, baby! Hello, baby! How are you doing over there? You look so good to me, all size, not inky blackness outside. That must mean it's a good day for you and me! I'm alright! A man came to the house this morning. Yes? His name is Guillaume. No! Do you know him, 
Sure. I mean, no now. What are you doing, lady? Evangeline? Evangelion? Evangelion. <laughs> ah, what is that? Holy fucking fucker fuck! Jesus Christ, get away from me! Holy balls in heaven! Oh, no, I get out of here, please don't be a dead end, oh god. Ah! Okay! I have to carry on! I am very sorry for how blown out the audio was there. I did not know what was going on! God, that was like the most terrifying. I didn't even get a good look at what it was. No, 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 no. You do not put me all the way back here, you bastard. You do not put me all the way back here. God damn it. Oh my God. Was it all a dream? Was it all a dream? Not real? Was it not real? I don't know about that, good friend. Dreams are real, John. Even the ones inside your head. Okay, good advice. Substantial. Okay, so you're telling me that what every- What was it? What was that monster? Good question, that's what I want to know. to call him a monster. He used to be your partner, until you betrayed him. Oh life. man, I tensed up so hard. If there is a monster in these halls, it is only one that you created. Good to know, thanks lady. Thanks for being the informative voice of reason inside my head. Now what the hell was that thing? That was obviously the new monster that he created, and it was way faster and nothing that I ever expected out of Amnesia. Holy crap, that thing was fast. It was just creepy crawly because it was low to the ground and I did not like it. So anyway, there's gotta be a way to get to the office. Now those doors are both locked, I think. Good golly, Miss Molly, that was... Yeah. Ugh. Okay. So that's why this game is utterly terrifying by some accounts. And I don't- I have no idea what I need to do now. So I need to get to the office. There's gotta be a safe somewhere around here. Find a painting. Somewhere in the original area. But then again, my guess was, before I got completely disoriented by what just happened, was that there may have been a safe in this room. I don't know if I ever actually tried behind- Alexander's face. Ah, but then maybe. Maybe I'm not. Maybe I'm on to something. Maybe I'm not. Hello, Alexander. You're very close to my head. Ugh. I didn't. I did not like that very much, by the way. Don't know if you picked up on that, but I was not having a fun time. So now what I need to do is I guess I need to go back until I find an office. Is this door? I heard something originally behind that door in the last episode, so I'm assuming that there might be something there again. I've just kind of gotten used to the darkness by now. Although maybe I shouldn't. Oh, maybe- Oh, this was a safe! Oh, that was a safe! I had no idea- Does a safe have to make such creepy sounds and invoke a piano? I had no idea that was actually a safe. I never even thought about that. That never crossed my mind. Can I get a lantern? Pl oh, oh, that's just a chemical. Tiny Box Tim, are you in here? I could really use your company right now. Things are not going very well for me. I don't know if you knew this, but I miss you with all my heart, Tiny Box Tim. I love you! You will always be in my heart of hearts, even in the darkest times. So there's nothing else in here besides that chemical. And now I need to go back the way I came and confront that monster goo goo. The monster magoo goo. You gotta kill me, maybe. But then again, wasn't there a hole in the wall over here? Okay. Oh, okay, I can just open it. Oh, it is dark in there. It would be a really bad time for a monster Magoo to jump out of there. Is there something I need to put in here? Oh, no, okay, those, so these chemicals, I knew this in the back of my head, I just never said it. These chemicals are gonna be joined together to create the fuel cell. And then I'm gonna take it out of the machine and put it in that machine to hopefully go up to the third floor. And then I never, ever, 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 ever have to meet up with that douche McGee again. Why is it so dark in here? Oh, it is so dark. Oh, it is so dark. Why is it pitch blackness? That is literally pitch blackness. I do not like that. I'm not getting used to the darkness. Oh, hello, Mr. Piano Man. Good to see you again. Hello, Mr. Phonograph Lady. Oh, this is the room where the guy got me. Okay, I got it. Is there any more messages for you, lady? You want to see Guillermo? Guillermo del Toro. My name is Totoro. <laughs> no! Oh, 
Oh no 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 What the hell is that? Who's plucking on the heartstrings of terror? Seriously though, was that the calling card to that thing in my bobber? Because I do not want to meet him again. That is like, ah, uh, God. This is, it reminds me of the first time when I met the Moose Man or the Thing Thing or Mr. Face. Ugh, I do not like you. Oh, God. I feel like, you know, normally I want to like see things, but I have every reason to never, ever, ever want to see that thing. It reminds me of the, um, the thing from SCP Containment Breach. The, uh, the thing if you look at the face, you die, die, die. You die, die. You don't just die, you die three times over. In a very horrible way. But it reminds me of that thing when it's crawling on the ground super fast at you. And I do not like it. Okay. So I should be able to make a straight shot up to the place where I need to go. I find myself going very slowly through this area. Just in total apprehension of what's in front of me. Some tell me it was a bad choice. Some tells me I made a mistake. Some tell me I'm a dumb dumb. Some tell me I'm a moron. Hello. Hi. Is there a monster in here? Are you gonna cry? Are you gonna cry for me? Please don't cry for me. Don't cry over my grave that you're about to make for me. Oh, I, I, f I really do find myself creeping through this area. It reminded me of the first time when I was also, uh, when I was in the, um, oh god, what was it? It was the, uh, dungeon area, the jail cells of the original game Amnesia. I find my, I found myself going through those so slowly, because it was just, it's just pitch blackness. I swear it's darker than it was before. I am not crazy in that regard. It is actually darker. So anyway. So I think it was through here. <laughs> oh. Okay. Cool. Great. I'm glad that happened. I'm glad. I'm glad that happened. I'm real glad. Thank you. God, fuck you, man. Jesus. That's God. Like I said, the maker of this mod is very good. No, 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 I'm not gonna look. Ah, you're making me look. What's there? What is it? 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 I can't see what it is. What is it? What is it? What is it? Is it a head? Is it a bottle? What is it? Why do I need to look? Turpentine. Turpentine. Okay. Are you saying I need a turpentine to get away from the monster? What? Huh? What? Why? What did I do? Okay, good. I'm coughing blood now. I'm coughing blood back onto my own face. Why? Why are you doing this to me? Why am I doing this to me? Why am me do this to me, me? Passing out on the floor. Good sign. Dying? Am I dying? What is going on? That's another thing that I like about horror games, especially when they have a sense of mystery about I them. Remember now. Oh! I killed myself in this room. Oh! Oh, okay! You picked your poison well. You died quickly, <sighs> not without pain. My wrist hurts. Then I must be in hell, doomed to suffer for my damnable sin. Which was? Hell is only a human invention. Uh huh. Though you may call it that, it feels more comfortable. Okay. It, it is doesn't. It's not for your suicide that you are being punished, John, but for the event that inspired it. I didn't kill my wife. I don't remember. Yeah. I can only remember sorrow. Okay, I have a guess. What did I do? Is it to do with Guillaume? I cannot give you the answers, John. 
Okay, I think I know. I have, a, I have actually a solid guess of what happened. Total seriousness. What I think happened is Guillaume came to the house finally and tried to kill me, but my wife Evangeline stepped in the way, died, I was extremely sad, and it was my fault because I never told anyone and I didn't resolve it. I let my greed get the best of me, and therefore I am punished for it. Because my wife, totally innocent, died. Because of my actions. ka -chunk. Am I close? Okay, step away from the spinning doodad. Goody goody gumdrops. You know, I, I, I did... There was so much detail put into a machine for pigs in terms of just like the random stuff that was happening along there. Okay, so I got an electric fuse. What does that mean? It's not a fuel cell. Do I still put it in the machine down there? Okie dokie. So I'm going out now. Wait, what? Where's it? Oh, yeah, down. So I take this fuel cell and then I go about my business and do what exactly? Ugh. This game keeps me guessing because I have no goddamn idea when the scares are gonna come. Which is good, I suppose. So I have this fuel cell, or not a fuel cell, I have an electric cell. No, not that way. That's not where I want to go. That's not where I want to go either, this is the wrong way. So I need to back- No! No, no, no! You stay in your- ah! I thought that was gonna be locked! I sincerely thought that was gonna be locked! I am not okay with this game! I am not okay with this. You are being a sassy bitch. And I wanna go home. I'm gonna close this door behind me, all polite. Thank you for clicking shut. Gonna go this way. I know the game was just giving me a shortcut back and I should be more appreciative of its actions, but somehow, I wanted to die a douchey death. So let me, what the, wait a minute. Is this the way I went? No, this doesn't feel right. Where am I going? I thought, no. No, 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 no. I made a wrong turn somewhere. That's locked. Wait a minute, no, 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 no. Oh, oh, it ended up on the other side of the chasm there. No, wait, what? No, that's not right. Wait, huh? Wait a minute, no, my, I, oh, okay, there we go. That's what I thought. I was utterly confused and utterly turned around there. I had no idea which way I was going. Guys, game is doing. No, seriously, this game is honestly one of the scariest custom stories I've ever played. It was such a progressive intro to the, like, the the terror aspect of it, which, like, most games is like, blah, horror, and it, it need not be like that. It never need be like that. It needs to be elegant, as elegant as it is mysterious in its execution. And for this, I love this one. Stuck in my own mind. I was right when I said I was in my own mind. But maybe not even in my own mind. I'm actually dead. Or at least that's what I'm led to believe. Perhaps I am not dead. Perhaps death is only the beginning of my torment. Was this open before? Yeah, it was. So I need to take this electric fuse and put it in the machino that I saw before I came to this area. And I do know I don't know why, but I'm at, I'm having extreme amounts of trouble remembering where I've been. Oh, this is nice again. I'm glad that this got fixed up. Guillermo, did you do this? Guillermo? Guillermo. At least it's not pitch black anymore. Okay, still can't move that. But there is a violin in this chair. Was this always here? Don't know. Was that my wife's? Ah, throw it up against the wall. Who cares? I do. Maybe I don't. Maybe I'm an asshole. Maybe I'm just a douche who killed my wife. Maybe it wasn't Guillermo that killed my wife. Maybe I killed my wife in preparation of trying to meet with Guillermo, the demon that I made up in my mind because I was paranoid that he was trying to kill me. And I ended up doing it. What the? Wait a minute. No, no, no. No. No, yes, no? Where? God, I keep getting turned around. No. Oh, there we go. Okay, here we go. Got it, got it, got it. I got it. Everybody calm down. I have it all under control. Oh, I got the heebie-jeebies all over the place. The heebie-jeebies, as scientifically quantifiable, are the scaredy weirdies But in a more amplified fashion. So is that now good? It wasn't a fuel cell like you said, it was- What? What happened? Why did sound get out? This happened before, but I was just wondering if it was meant to be like this. Okay. I need to fix this. BRB. Alright, so I'm back and still recording. Sorry about that. It's just, uh, I think the methodology of which I'm monitoring my own voice, uh, is causing some sound issues, but it shouldn't be a problem from here on out. 
So let's see where this third floor really goes. Wait a minute, I'm going down. I need to go to the third floor. Is the third floor down? I think, I think there may be some confusion in the insanity inside my mind. I need to, okay, never mind. We're in a crazy world where up is down and left is right and butts are not nice. So, where are we going? Am I gonna see a machine for pigs? Is it really a machine for me? Oh good, I like the way the door just dissolves. I don't think I'm gonna step into that darkness. If you don't mind, I'd rather do anything but that. But here I go, because I'm brave for you guys viewing at home. I will... Okay, bye! Have fun! I'll just be down here, you come get me whenever you're ready. Oh god. I remember one particular comment that said that the basement was not a fun place. Is there a- Okay... There, there just happened to be a tiny box around here. Have anyone seen a tiny box? His name is Tim and I love him. Okay. Moving for... Ward. Moving forward. Very slowly. Okay. I don't like this place! I'm just gonna say that right now. I do not like this place very much at all. Uh, it is dark. It is dark. God, this is like the creepiest I've ever seen amnesia for a long time. What is that sound? It sounds like boxes moving around, but I'm not sure. Someone there? Is anybody there? Anybody? Anybody there? No. Is that the skittering of a cockroach or is that the... Rapid approach of a monster that I need to run away from. I am going to die down here. I literally am going to die down here. Okay, so there's a box there. Let's see, I'll push that down. Nothing there, so I just need to go. Okay, I may have just screwed myself over because I need to get all the boxes out so that I can open this closet, which probably has a monster in it. I'm just gonna say. Why else would I need to unbury and unleash something that is deep down in this basement? Why else would I be here? Why else? There's no other reason. I do not see Tiny Box Tim anywhere. This is a good idea. This is a good idea. Hello. If you're evil, you'd tell me, right? Okay. I have a sledgehammer! I can use it. I know how to use this! <sighs> this is literally not cool. This is just about- <gasps> Hi, statue. I didn't see you till just now. Should I throw my giant sledgehammer into your face? Okay. Well, that was anticlimactic. So what am I supposed to do with it? Shut up. Stop whispering in my ear. Your evil will not work here! I am a man of many convictions. I can't even open that. I don't even know why I'm trying to be quiet. I just, like, it's so quiet in here. Shut up! Shh! Cockroaches. The monster will hear you. Oh god, I'm so tense right now. My shoulders hurt. Shut up. No. Thank you. Not tough you're in. Oh, I see. Shh. Okay. Don't know if I did that. But just gonna move on. I see what I need this for. Oh. Uh! That was way too damn loud! Tiny, no. Tiny, no. No tiny. Okay. 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 Room of warm happiness or room of warm deathiness? Okay. Okay. Oh god. Ah, that was like the slowest I've ever gone through any game ever in the history of ever. Master bedroom key. Where the hell was the master bedroom? What is over here? I can't see! Is there something over here? Something over here. Oh, I see. That's like, uh, that was, uh, back to the way I was. Um, in the beginning, there was a way to look through here. This is where I was looking through originally. Is there something in here? No. Okay. Place to hide, maybe? Okay. What? So dark. So dark. So dark! No, 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 no! Yes. 
I don't know. So dark, can't see anything. Hello? Hello? Why are you facing me? No, you don't dare, you bitch. Shut up. Okay. 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 Just gonna get out. I'm just gonna go. I'm just gonna go. I'm just gonna go. I'm just gonna go. No one's gonna bother me. Nothing's gonna hurt me. I'm just gonna go. Everything's fine. Everything's totally cool. Everything's totally cool. No! Everything is not cool! Everything is everything but cool! Oh, okay, okay, okay. No, 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 no. Closet, closet, closet. Safe zone. Happy place. Oh, close the doors. No. Maybe he's not. I don't know. Okay. Maybe he didn't get anywhere near me. Maybe he's absolutely nowhere. I need to go out and check. I don't want to. But for you guys, I'd do anything. Right? What am I supposed to do? What am I supposed to do? What am I supposed to do? Oh, I can't see anything! What am I supposed to do? What am I... No, thank you! What am I supposed to do? Okay. No, 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 no! No, 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 no! This is the most terrifying noise I've ever heard. And are you there? Are you in the darkness? Are you coming for me? What do I need to do? What do I do? Oh God, what do I do? Oh, it's dark. It's dark. It's dark. It's dark. I got a chair. I have a chair. I haven't used a chair in forever. I haven't felt the need to use a chair in forever. I actually legitimately think this is my only defense between me and that asshole. What are you gonna do to me? What are you gonna do to me when you find me? Oh fuck! I can't! <sighs> mm. Ah! Okay! Me no likey that! Ah. <sighs> to kill me! Oh, again with the supposed to kill me-ness! You son of a bitch. Oh, God. Oz. God. I'm to die over and over? Why are you forcing me into this twisted game? Okay. It is necessary, Jean, Ugh. to atone for your sin. Each step you take has a purpose. Ooh. The right. Your labors cause you great pain. Yeah. Draw you closer and closer to the truth. To the truth. Good. Good Don't to hear. Remember what I did. Just tell me what to do to end this, and I'll do it. Right. You need only keep moving, Jean. Return to the elevator. And go to the third floor. I know. Go to the third floor. Oh. Then you will understand why you are here. Okay. I already know why I'm here, I guess my reason. Maybe you don't need to destroy me. Alright, either way. Anyway, this episode was probably the most scariest, <laughs> the most, the scariest episode of Amnesia I've ever recorded. And that is awesome that this game can still scare me and surprise me. And that the developer is able to deliver such amazing scares. That was awesome. Although I felt like I was the instrument of my own destruction there because I probably shouldn't have run away so effectively from it. I'm very good at doing that, but either way, hope you're still enjoying this uh, uh, custom story. So thank you all so much for watching. Remember, there's a whole bunch more in the description if you want to check out my older custom stories. Thanks again, everybody, and as always, I will see you in the next video. Bye-bye! Ah! Go! Oh, 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 oh,